This video is sponsored by minifigs.me. Stay to the end to find out how you can get discounts on custom Lego minifigures. My partner and I are huge fans of the Untitled Goose game, so it felt only right to build our Agent of Chaos in Lego. The problem is, I just couldn't stop there. I had to build it a home, then a garden, and then, well, it's kind of become a fully-fledged working Lego board game. Allow me to introduce the Lego Untitled Goose Game board game. It's a two-player board game featuring one chaotic goose and an innocent groundskeeper. The goose's objective is to place an array of items elsewhere on the board before becoming eligible to retrieve the village's bell from the miniature castle and return it to its home. The groundskeeper's objective is to keep the goose away, retrieve the broom and take the key before locking up the miniature castle, thereby stopping the goose for good. The rules are set out here, but I figured you'd want to see the game in action, so here we are playing it. Right, goose goes first. Three. Tails, so that is anti-clockwise, which is there. You're playing very risky, very risky. Very risky indeed. That was stupid. That was a rubbish one. Oh, that was better. Mm. Oh, I love that the groundskeeper is slightly bent forward, so it's like, I'm coming for you! <laughs> it's difficult with this game because I wanted it to have... I wanted the groundskeeper to have a bit of agency with it. You've got the mug. Well done. Yes. And it's kind of hard because it's just a flip of a coin deciding where I'm going, so a lot of it is down to chance. But... There's a fun in that as well, but theoretically you could play it by yourself. I'm gonna go for the coin this time. Mm -hmm. Mixing things up a little bit. Tails, counterclockwise. Well, that's the good thing about the goose. The goose can do any of those three things in whatever order it wishes, as long as it does all those three things before it gets to the bell. And then this workstation has got a coin in the top drawer and a key in the bottom for the groundskeeper. Coin. Very well demonstrated. Thank you. I'm going to keep it facing you. <laughs> it's always a gamble on the goose's part as to which direction will favour it the most. If you want to play it safe, there's a lot of cat and mouse involved. Counterclockwise, I'm going that way. You've got it in the bag, mate. Coins in the well. Coins in the well. Which isn't something that you actually need to do as a task in the game, but I, I enjoyed doing that part so much that I thought it would be fun. So the reason for the heads and tails thing is I wanted it to, the groundskeeper to kind of act a bit like an NPC. So he'll wander around aimlessly like he would. Like he does in the game. Like he would in the game until he sees the goose. And at this stage, the goose can be caught within one step. Five. Oh. One, two, three, four, five. five. Excellent, right, so now I've caught the goose. Um, and the goose now has to drop the item that it had, in which case it's the hat. All the way back home. And the goose has to also go all the way back home. Now the groundskeeper um, now has three moves to do what it likes. So we can put the coin away and I can go and either get the broom or the key. Um, easiest for me is to get the broom because the broom gives me an advantage. One, two, three, four. Now if I roll two ones, then you, <laughs> be you'll be fine. Okay, well that's the first one. <laughs> Uh, four, oh, one, two. Okay, so now I have a broom, and the broom is great. It gives me an advantage because it means that I can catch the goose within two squares instead of one. Okay, if this is heads, which it is, that's oh, good news no. to me. Five, <laughs> one, two, three, four. You go home, and I got three moves now. One, four, one, two, three, four. Now this has got to be one, two, three, four. Yeah, collect the key. Five. Five. Excellent. Okay, so I can go into the bottom drawer now, and I now have the shiny key. Ha ha ha. Now, if I catch the goose now, I'll have three goes to take this fence, put it on the miniature castle, and win the game for myself. So, good luck. Okay, you've got the hat again for the third time. Hats on the man. Finally. Tails. Six. Oh. Right, goodbye. You are now going home. Again. How many times two. is that now? One, two. I mean, I'm... Sorry? One, two, three, four, five. If I roll a one, you're fine. <laughs> okay, so you are very, very lucky this game. Oh, I'm a lucky goose. Now the goose has done 
all of its main objectives, it needs to get to that miniature castle, take the bell out and bring it all the way home. That's if I don't catch it first. One, two, three, four, five. She's got the bell. The horrible goose. And now you've got to get home without me catching you. Yep. Heads, so I'm going that way. Good news for you. Five. Very One, good two, news. three, four, five. All very, right. Very good news. You should have this in the bag now. I mean, I am going in your direction. Um, However, I'm only going two spaces. I need to get a four or above. Five will do. You got five! Yay! Right, so the goose goes all the way home. You've got the With bell. the bell. And you put the bell on, and the goose wins. Obviously, if I'd won, then this would be going here and locking the bell away. But you didn't win. Yeah. I did. No, yeah, you did. The goose is victorious once more. And what I like about this board as well is it's on a few different plates, so it is still breakable, but it's less flimsy than it was in my first design when I picked it up and it just went everywhere. It exploded. That was the, fun, wasn't it? You laughed exploded. for I about did. half an hour. Bit of an understatement. Now, if you're like me, you have a special place in your heart for Lego minifigures. They're small, don't require feeding, and rarely argue with you on Twitter. That's where minifigs.me come in. They create bespoke custom minifigures using real Lego parts for characters from pop culture, history, and music that you'd love to see Legofied, but for whatever reason haven't been. We're talking Doctor Who, Game of Thrones, Doctor Who, Avatar The Last Airbender, Doctor Who, and more, including Doctor Who. Check out their website and I guarantee you'll find something for you. They also sell separate pieces too, so you can peruse their range of accessories, hair pieces, and generally lovely bits and bobs to create a little someone of your own. For a one-time 10% off your next order, type in the following discount code at the checkout and you'll save a few bob on something truly special. Thank you for watching, take care, and I'll see you in the next video.